So clouds and radar showing that we are now in the calm behind yesterday's storms. We're peeling back the clouds, welcoming back sunshine. Exact track 40 calm, especially compared to yesterday evening. Your weather story though, that patchy fog is lifting as that sun is really burning it off. But 70s and 80s return to our forecast as those temperatures are warming up and then more rain expected going into your Thursday. We'll walk you through that in a second. But downtown Detroit right now, we are sitting in the 50s. 52 in Detroit, 50 in Ann Arbor, 46 in Port Huron, 53 in Adrian. And we have northwesterly winds at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Your forecast today holding on to the clear skies and warming up for your Wednesday, 66 around the lunch hour and 75 the afternoon high today. So definitely improvement from the last couple days where we were in the 60s. However, 79 is the average for this time of year. So coming up just shy of it, but pretty darn close to being seasonal. Allergy forecast, moderate levels of tree pollen, grass, ragweed. So we haven't seen a huge improvement on this over the last few days, but another round of rain might really help this out. So let's show you this rain. By noon tomorrow, some widespread showers are in the area. Now this might skirt past Lenawee and Monroe County, but you do have a couple chances as we get the later part of the day to our south. Otherwise, up into the thumb, really getting most of the action midday tomorrow when it comes to those showers. But by 5 p.m., we get a little break, maybe a few breaks in the clouds as well. But heading into the evening, some more showers could develop up by Sandusky. But going into the overnight, watch what happens right around here. I think Wayne County Monroe might see a few more light showers or sprinkles before we push that out for Friday. So precipitation totals were only at three quarters of an inch so far this month. So almost half of where we should be for this time of year. And we had a surplus at this point last year certainly not the case right now, but your future forecast shows that we are entering another dry pattern after tomorrow. We'll have highs in the low 80s this weekend for Father's Day and going into the early part of next week.